Some of you may remember seeing The Snowman when you were a kid, and like me, you forgot the name of the short film when you were much older. A friend of yours played the song from the short film, making you instantly ask the friend where the song is from, what the short film is called, and how old he or she was when they first saw the short film. The picture book it was based on wasn't about the holidays, but the short film expanded it to become a holiday picture. While the picture book and the short film have no spoken dialogue, the short film opens with a spoken intro. It's got this nostalgic, kind of sad, reflective mood of it, as it shows a man walking as the woods fade into animation with a brief, reflective narration. It's perfect. Studios re-released it later with an alternate intro with David Bowie, which sets up an excited for discovery kind of mood. David Bowie's wonderful, but the tone it sets up is different from what the original intro sets up. It was re-released again with an animated intro that's fun to watch, but again it sets up a different tone. I'm glad that the DVD release has stuck to the original intro, with the alternate intros serving as special features. Now if you get the DVD, or the Blu-ray if you get the import or live in a country that sells the Blu-ray, you're going to notice a special feature that discusses the impact of the snowman through the years, such as its impact in Japan with all of its merchandise, and the impact of the song Walking in the Air. For those who haven't seen it, or have seen it and don't remember it, it involves a boy who builds a snowman, only to find that the night after he builds it, the snowman comes to life. They go on a really fun and amazing adventure. They crack jokes around the house, and then they head outside, and then they go on a flight to the North Pole, where they meet other snowmen and meet Father Christmas. Or you can call him Santa Claus. That might sound like the Polar Express, but trust me, they're not alike. The animation is beautiful, as you can see. For those of you who have seen it, what do you think of the ending of it? I love and embrace the brokenness of it. It has this sense of a loneliness theme, which again goes back to why I think the original intro sets up the short film perfectly. Themes of reflection, reflecting on loved ones that you may not have in your life anymore. Another reason why the original intro sets it up perfectly. How it captures this one amazing night with a one night friend and that's all it was meant to be. Sometimes it's worth it for that. To be happy that you have that memory and that gift. It will be in your heart forever. The theme of lost loved ones. You love them even if it was only for one night. As long as you love them, they last forever. That's an important message for kids and it's impacted me even more as an adult. I think the snowman resonates very well with those who feel that they are missing someone or something in their lives at the holiday season. The filmmakers were very thoughtful in making this for them. For those reasons, the snowman is a major favorite of mine, and I hope that you will take the time to view this 30-minute short film this holiday season. Happy Christmas!